What is up guys, Zack Scott here, playing Pokemon Sword, and uh, last time I beat the Gym Leader here, Gym Leader Gordy, that battle was brilliant, that Gym Leader was tough, but you had no trouble, that's because I was using F-Dog. Churchester has some really great restaurants. I got some things I want to talk to you about, so let's head to the restaurant to celebrate your win. The name of the restaurant is Bob's Your Uncle, so I've been, you know, that's what I was talking about last episode, is I went to Bob's Your Uncle, I couldn't eat, but maybe now I can finally eat, and, uh, <laughs> Guys, thanks for joining me again for yet another episode, hopefully a fantastic episode, of Pokemon Sword. The first episode has over a million and a half views, thanks to yous. So, <laughs> thank you. Hop Zero, great. Get out of here, Hop. This is between me and Sonya. Got that gym bad Z-Dog? Nice one. Oh, hey, there you are. Yeah, Hop wasn't able to get it. He's just smiling, but he's not really smiling on the inside. <laughs> I've been trying to find out more about the Darkest Day in the Sword and Shield Pokemon, but still no luck. But then look at that, look at that, the tapestry. Wait, hold on. Ta-da. Look at that. No way, what's this? A new chapter in the old gallery red, a fifth tapestry, an absolutely fantastic poster. Let's just say, let's just say a fifth tapestry. The heroes look sad and where are the sword and shield? What was the meaning of this picture? And into some kind of seal? I don't know, man. And into the legend? Hmm, perhaps when their duty was completed, they went uh, into some kind of sleep. Based on those statues we saw back in Stone Side, the sword and shield were actually two Pokemon, right? Now they're buried. That's right. That's my take on it, at least. You remember that Pokemon we met that day? Do you think it could have been one of them, either the sword or the shield Pokemon? You, you met them? Come on, you know what I'm talking about, right, Z-Dog? In the slumbering wield? Yeah, that could have been it, exactly. The mad Pokemon we ran into uh, in the fog. Don't you think that could have been it? Oh, that's right. You lot have been in the slumbering wield. I only started on this journey because my grand told me to, but this is turning into be too much fun. You've got to tell me more. How about we discuss this over a meal? Go on, what do you want to eat? Let's get our orders in. All right, what do I want to eat? Do I not get to decide for myself? I guess not. Never mind. Fascinating. All right, the next thing to do now that we've done eating is have a look around Churchester. Let's inspect the hero's bath. All right. Sure enough, hero's bath time. Hop is just gunning for it, running and gunning for it. All right, what's up? The hero's bath. They say this is where the two heroes came to soothe their wounds after the battle to bring down the evil presence long ago. Nowadays, only Pokemon really use the hero's bath, though. Hmm, who exactly were the heroes that bathed here? I think I'll have to look into that. You two met a mysterious Pokemon back in the slumbering wheel. Perhaps you two can become new heroes. No, not Hop. Please not Hop. Hop. <laughs> what, like some hero waving around a sword and shield? Pull the other one. Though I guess I'd fancy a shield if I had to take my pick. Yeah, that's right, because I'm playing sword right now. What kind of battle do you think the heroes had back then? <laughs> Why don't we show her, Z-Dog? Think you can pull off a real heroic battle? Uh, give me a minute. Give me a minute. No, absolutely. Let's just go for it. Sonya uh, treated us to a great meal after that curry. I feel like we got the energy to wrestle a beware. All right, I don't entirely understand your reasoning, but I might just as well see what you can do. I'll heal up your Pokemon for you, Z-Dog, so give it your best. All right, so here we go against Hop. Time for a little exhibition match, starting the future champion, me. It's me, I'm the future champion. All right, we are not in a town, we're like out in the wild suddenly. Here comes Pokemon trainer Hop. He's gonna send out Dub Wool. Can't do much about that. Uh, Dub Wool. I think, is that just a normal? Looks flammable. So, <laughs> let's see. Uh, yeah, it is just a normal. So hey, fighting, right? Brick break, over your face. Here you go, wha-bam. Goodbye to you. Super effective. Now that's a proper move. Yep, the posing double fainted. All right, that was great. Congratulations to me. Oh, I got hit by hail. Oh, hail, no. Uh, Corviknight, a flying type, of course. I mean, is it a dark flying? I always forget what, it, but if he's got a full-on Corviknight, 
uh, then it is a flying steel. Oh my god, flying steel. Um, okay, so that means we're talking about fire as a weakness. Also, <laughs> oh man, no, the fighting is canceled out by the flying. Okay, well, darn it. Still, ground moves could work. Nope, flight, flight eliminates that. Anyway, okay, let's just get on with it. Let's do, um, let's do fire. Let's switch uh, Pokemon. I'm gonna uh, switch Pokemon to uh, Sea Dog here. Go Lurk has no gender. Swap Pokemon. Come on, F Dog. Let's do this. All right, Corviknight. And then uh, let's just do a Pyro Ball, super effective. Unless it misses, then it's not effective at all. But it's, this one's gonna hit. Boom, Corviknight's dead. Corviknight's a beautiful bird, beautiful black bird. All right, great job. And then, uh, see, come on, see, I'll get hit by the hail too. Uh, Pinchurchin? <laughs> I don't know who these people are, man. Pinchurchin. Oh my gosh, how come I can't Google this? Oh, I, I put a, I put an H there. Pin, Pinchurchin. I don't know, man. It's electric. We know that. It, we can do a ground move, right? I don't have any ground moves against electric. That's the thing, I don't really have a lot against electric. Let's just catch him on fire. Let's just say, keep current Pokemon. All right, fight you with another Pyro Ball. Let's see, oh, he's only level 39. If this hits, then it's gonna be great. Well, bam Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Creaming him. Oh, a D-Dog leveled up, that's nice. Ow. Snorlax, that's a normal, so I'm gonna switch back to uh, F-Dog here. He might level up after this. He's got a great fighting move coming up. There we go, Snorlax. Brick break over your face. Oh, he's still, no, he's not. I thought he was still gonna be alive, but that was a critical hit, good. Steady on, partner, I feel your pain and we'll get them back for it. No, you're not, Hop. Hop, you can't even, you couldn't even beat Gordy. You're not gonna beat me. F-Dog and C-Dog both leveled up. And wants to learn the move Bounce. Let's see about that, let's see. Do I actually wanna learn the move Bounce or not? Uh, it's a flying move, 85-85. Uh, you know what? I don't even really use headbutt, or actually, I, I don't use flame charge anymore. I you know I kind of do use flame charge. But I don't. Let's get rid of it and use bounce, sure. Although, it's, it's a really risky flying move. Let's forget flame charge. Although, this does build up my speed stat. Dude, I don't know, man. What do you think? I could get rid of headbutt. I kind of like all of these things, man. I like I like I like to be able to hit him with like a weak shot if I'm trying to like capture a Pokemon. Fire Pledge is pretty strong. This is definitely strong. Um, and I don't have the grass equivalent of that. I don't even know how to do that. But uh, let's get rid of headbutt. Because I don't really use it. It's a strong attack. It might make him flinch. I'd rather, I don't know. I think I'd rather keep flame charge in order to help boost my speed if I need to. I don't know. I can always, uh, I don't know. I'm gonna forget headbutt. I know this is weird, but I'm gonna forget headbutt. I don't really ever use headbutt, so. There we go. Bounce instead. Dang it, got hit by the hail. Uh, Rillaboom! I, I forget what Rillaboom is. So I'm just gonna search for it really quick. Rillaboom is a gra- Oh yeah, it's a big old grass type. So that's gonna be flammable, right? So let's switch back uh, to... 
Let's switch. Let's switch. Uh, switch Pokemon. Let me try out my new flying move because grass is weak against flying as well. And I just want to see what happens. I want to see this in action. The bounce move. Just like test the waters, you know. Even though the water here will all be frozen. <laughs> All right, I think you got me cornered. Not even close. <laughs> It'll be the greatest when I steal it. No, you're not gonna. I didn't even see what you're, you're trying to brag or something, but it's not gonna work. It was so ridiculous, I couldn't even focus on what you were saying. Let's fight and do a, everything super effective against this guy. So here we go. Bounce. Here we go. Oh, I'll see you soon. Oh, this is one of those moves. I got hit by hail <laughs> way up at this guy. So did he. Here comes my bounce, I guess. Oh, he avoided the attack? What? What? You kicked off my charcoal? I better get that back. I'm gonna be mad if I can't get that back. All right, here's the thing, you dork. I'm just gonna burn you then. Let's do Fire Pledge. Should be good enough. Maybe not, though. Nope, oh, close. Super effective, darn it. Here comes Brick Break. Man, okay, you're annoying me. Here, this is where I would use the, uh... Ha! The hail almost got him. Let's do flame charge. Oh, freaking took a hyper potion. I should have known. Whatever. I hate you. I'm, I'm gonna take one too, then. Ha ha ha! Super effective! Lucky me. That was pretty good. Alright. Hop is here. And dead. I still can't even beat you, my true rival. But I think I'm starting to see the light. I'm gonna knock your lights out, dude. All right, that was fun. Not. Thanks. You you took a right proper battle. At this rate, you're both going. Even the unbeatable Leon may be in trouble. So what's next, you two? I plan to look into things in the slumbering wield. I'm going to keep challenging that gym. Then once I get that gym badge, I'll be heading to Route Nine to take on Spike Muth next. All right. Good luck. Seems like he finally shook off that gloom. Leon worried if Hop, uh, Leon to worry if Hop wasn't feeling all right. As his rival, you wouldn't like it either, right? See ya. As his, I'm not, a, I'm not a, his like role model or anything. I'm, I'm his like rival. I want to see him fail. <laughs> all right, let's uh, go ahead and heal up my Pokemon. I better have that charcoal. I keep doing this freaking. Does he still have the charcoal? Okay, thank God. I gotta go heal up. She could have, you know, she could have healed me up before. She healed me up before the battle. Why not after? Fine, that's fine. I'm gonna go over here then and excuse me Go down here And then fully heal my Pokemon one more time And I like to rest my Pokemon I wish I knew what the next gym was So I would know uh, what to do I'm gonna put, I think I'm gonna put Sea uh, Dog back into the primary spot. Golurk is the one of the weaker ones right now. I don't even know if Golurk is one that I wanna keep. So, haven't quite figured this all out. Anyway, I've already explored everything here. So now I'm going down another route. <laughs> down here round nine hey how's it going fisherman woman meeting a trainer can only mean a battle what a simple concept all right so what do we got here what are, what are you gonna send out here Fisher Harriet is gonna send out what uh, Barrascuta that's pretty cool now that's a water type right I bet it is, and water is weak to, uh, oh, it's the opposite. Water is not good against fire electric. I gotta switch to electric really quick. Um, so let's do that. So Pokemon switch Pokemon. Um, Bar uh, yeah, Pokemon, Pokemon. We want T-Dog out here. And overdrive is gonna be a really good move because of the sound stuff I got going on. Here comes Crunch. Ow, ow. Oh, My defense fell. That's okay. He got hit by hail. Me too. Alright. I'm going to fight with Overdrive. We'll see what happens. 
Aqua Jet, come on. Come on. Comes overdrive. I'm gonna have to take a potion already. Gotcha, big time. All right, go lurk leveled up. Why? Why am I hit by hail again? You got another one to send out. Lantern. Uh, let's see. Let's see what lantern is all about. Lantern is a, a water electric. So if we take a look at what that's, uh, we're talking about grass and ground. I don't have either. I don't have either. So uh, fires off the table. Fighting. I could, you know, I could use fighting. Because it's it's neutral. So let's bring out F Dog again. Plus F Dog is pretty strong. Here we go. Land turn. Break break over your face. Here we go. Boom. Ha ha ha. Ah, what? Discharge. What is this? Don't discharge me. All right, got hit by hail again. All right, one more time, one more time. All right. Our dog leveled up to level 50. The stronger one always wins, how simple. All right, so, uh, <laughs> so we could like, 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 look, do I want to fish for something here? Maybe. The heck was that? The thing just jumped. How do I even get into the water? Don't make no sense. Here we go. What did I get? Uh, wishy washy. I don't know what this is. It's probably, is it just a water type? Wishy washy, wishy washy, wishy washy is a, uh, water type. What the heck is schooling? What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, okay. Hi. So just a water type. So I'm going to need an electricity type. Probably, but if I want to capture it, you know, I'm... Uh, I. Hmm, let's just try... I'm going to try to fight. I know I'm going to be weak against this. Let's try flame charge. Hopefully this uh, weakens them a little bit. Oh, wow. Not at all. It's okay. My speed rose soak is gonna really hurt me bad. I know that I'm weak against this. Sea dog's t what? Sea dog's type changed to water? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a bigger move. Here we go with this this uh, fire pledge. I know that. Oh wow, even worse. That's okay. Not very effective. Uproar. So my type is. Why would you switch my type to water? Ow. I'm just trying to like whittle them down a little bit. All right, here, I'm gonna do this pyro ball. This shouldn't be any big deal. Again, I'm just trying to weaken it. There you go. I'm ready to capture this. It's just a, I, I just like the way it looks. Stop, you're hurting my ears. All right, uh, let's go ahead and do a net ball, I think. Schooling again. What? Okay. She stopped schooling. All right. Does it matter which form I, ca I capture him in? I want a net ball. Here we go. This is a water type, so get him in there, hopefully. Nice. All right. Wishy washy was caught. T-Dog leveled up. And then, uh, so yeah, add it to the Pokédex. Individually, they're incredibly weak. It's by gathering up this into schools that they're able to con con confront opponents. No nickname and send to the BOX. All right, great. T-Dog is pretty injured. That's okay. I don't care. I don't care. Should I fish over here? Let's just see. Let's just see. Oh, I did it too early. I, I, thought, I thought it did it, but it didn't do it. Anyway, let's just go. What's going on, guys? What the heck are these? 
excuse me. Max potion. You guys all look crazy. Sup? My Pokemon are all pumped up from dancing with me. Are you ready for us? I guess so. Uh, Dancer Zoe is gonna send out, what kind of ball is that? Uh, Darumaka. What the heck is that? Darumaka is what? I, I can't even guess. It looks like an ice type maybe? Ice dark It would be my guess if I had to completely guess. Uh, it's an, uh, yeah, the Galarian version is an ice version. So, uh, ice is of course, believe it or not, uh, weak to fire. So just get ready for a fire pledge should be enough probably. Here you go. I hope that's enough. Yeah, yeah there you go. Super effective. I got it right that it was ice. I I, I just thought dark because it sounded sounded bad. Okay, so we got another thing coming out. What else you got? Uh, Bella Blossom. Sounds like a plant type. Let's see. Uh, Bell Awesome. Uh, I mean grass, grass. I, I guess it is grass type, and of course grass is very susceptible to fire. So keep current Pokemon, we will catch them on fire. Bell Awesome. Let's do another fire pledge, that's probably good enough. Nice. Super effective again. All right, Dancer Zoe. Wow, you and your Pokemon make a combo that throws out moves like an elegant dance. All right, she's, she's wearing a bare midriff in the snow. All right, Surchester Bay. Can I, can I hop across this? What is this bridge for if I can't cross it? I don't even know what I'm doing here. Oh no. No, Team Yell, you leave that thing alone. There's no way I'm letting you anywhere near Spike Myth. And that means we can't let you go on Route 9. It's Team Yell's duty to cheer on those lovely Dreadnoughts. Oh, they're nice with them. Okay, but we also don't yell at them, though. And we also get to stop people from heading out over the water. The bite. All right, well, Team Yell, you're going down. Uh, yes, I understand. All I'm saying is that I, I can make it so that Rotom Bikes can ride on water. Oh, that'd be nice. Do that for me, please. Why, we meet again, my young gym challenger friend. Remember me? I gave you that bike. So you think you could do me another favor and teach these ruffians a lesson or two? Absolutely. It's our duty to protect Dreadnought, and that means you're going to need to give up on the gym challenge. You look like you need convincing, so how about a Pokemon battle? How about yes? I'll send you packing for the sake of Dreadnought, of course. Is Dreadnought coming out? Is he fighting with Dreadnought? Timmy, yeah, just, just one grunt. Uh, Lenoon. It's a stinky Pokemon. Lenoon is a uh, dark normal. So, fighting. It'll be weak against fighting. Yeah, for sure. Because because even even dark is weak against fighting. So, let's switch out to F-Dog here. And we'll do a... As soon as I get a chance, I'll do a Brick Smash or whatever. Brick Break. Alright, F-Dog is here. Counter. What do you mean counter? I didn't do anything. Got hit by the hail, though. Me too. All right, let's do it. Let's uh, brick break super effective. Here we go. Home claws. What does that do? Oh, your attack rose. Big deal because you're about to be <laughs> broken in half. There you go. Super effective. A critical hit. And Lenoon fainted. Great. Who's next? I got experience points. Sea dog leveled up again to 47. I got hit by hail again. We keep getting hit by hail out here. Uh, Pangoro, that's a fighting. That's got. A, is that a fighting type, Pangoro? It sounds like the the fighting type, right? If it is a fighting type, and it, it's a fighting dark, and so this one's a fighting dark. Fighting actually are not immune to fighting. So uh, let's go ahead and just uh, keep current Pokemon. We'll do. We'll use Brick Break on him because he's a dark, so he is weak to fighting. So it's a fighter who's weak against fighting, huh? How about that? Here we go. Bullet punch, ouch. Boom, that's a lot of bullets. Holy cow, that's like a machine gun. Brick break coming at you, boom. Excellent. Super effective, critical hit. Got him. 
All right. Gotcha, Sai. I want to go back to Spike Muth. I really do. All right, do I get to fight the other one next? Gah, he's going to ride the Dreadnought. I don't think I am, am I? Or maybe I will. Oh, I got an idea. We can get our, we can get on Dreadnought first and right away. All right, get a move on, Dreadnought. See you later, Gym Challenger. Can I ride my Dreadnought? I have a D-Dog. All right, so he, off he goes. Seems like you've come to my aid yet again. How's the cycling life been treating you? Are you having fun? Wouldn't it be great if you could ride your Rotom bike on water too? That's why I'm going to add these special parts, uh, allowing it to travel along the water's surface just for you. So I got a Rotom bike that can ride on water? Holy cow. That's amazing. All right, all right. With the Rotom bike water mode, you'll cruise across the water like a Pokemon with Swift Swim. By the by, when you're riding on land, we'll call it land mode. All right, thanks, dude. Awesome, oh my god, there's a big Pokemon there though. I don't know if I want to go out. I'm just gonna stay here and enjoy my life. Just kidding, be right back. All right, I'm back. Let's go ahead and uh, ride the waters then. Let's do it, uh, but I, I wanna kinda see, oh wow, look at this, look at this. Great zoom lens, and I need to be held by Pokemon. If the older moves after its target moves, his accuracy will be boosted, uh, okay. Uh, so there's something on the other side of that. That's what it's showing me, I think. I kind of want to see what's up here really quick. We can backtrack, uh, go over here. What are those? Anyway, let's go this way. I'm going to ride. Oh my god. So that thing's jumping all over the place. Maybe I can catch that. Come here. Come here. I want to catch you. Aha! That's cute. What is this? A wild mantike? Is it just a water type? Mantike. Let's see. Mantike is a water flying. Okay. And uh, so that means it's going to be weak against, let's see, water flying. Uh, electric. Totally weak against electric. But we don't want to faint it, do we? Let's switch. Uh, I'm going to switch to, if I want to catch this, I think I do. It's cute. I don't think I want to keep it, though. Uh, I don't think I want to keep it in my party, is what I mean. So let's switch uh, Pokemon. Something a little more. Let's let's do this. This is fine. Let's do uh, let's do let's do our dog so we can stomp him. Here we go. Here we go. Hello. Headbutt. All right. Let's stomp him. I, I hope you can resist this stomp. You don't look very stompable. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, perfect. All right, that's okay. Let's uh, let's. Okay, I hit, got hit by hail. I don't know. Can you withstand a hail hit? <laughs> oh, so close. We got to capture him. Uh, this is the netball, water or bug type. Here you go. Netball. Get in the netball. All right. Dang it! You broke out. You're gonna get killed by the hail. Oh, great. Well, you're going to get hit by hail way up there. <laughs> you should have gotten the netball, you dork. D-Dog leveled up. All right. Well, now what? Let's go this way, I guess. What is that? No, thanks. No, what we'll the stop swimming after me. Is there anything over here that's worth it? What is this bridge? Yeah, no. I don't really want a man tyke anyway. There he is again if I want to try for him. Hey, come on. You look cute. Oh, I think I got him. All right, let's try again. Jeez, I'm probably going to have to rest some of these Pokemon. It's hailing, I know. Let's go to, uh, go lurk. I need to use just a, I'm gonna have to use like an ultra ball on it or something. Headbutt. Ow. All right, let's try uh, just a uh, mega punch. Sure. Wait, which one's, which one's weaker? This is not very, let's do a not very effective move. 
Jeez. Not very effective. Almost killed him. All right. Uh. Ow, 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 ow. Uh, here we go. I'm gonna have to use an altered ball. Here we go. If we can capture that, that'll be nice. Dang it, come on! Aqua Ring. I'm gonna need to go heal my Pokemon before we move forward. What was that? What just happened? Veil of Water. Okay, let's do an Ultra Ball again, please. Let's capture this. What the heck, dude? Why can't I capture this? I'm using an Ultra Ball, and I'm like failing each time. It's only 39. I should. You're gonna die again, or you're gonna heal. One of the two. Uh, here, come on, Ultra Ball, let's do it. What is taking so long to capture this? What? Um. I don't get why I can't capture this. Get in there. I don't have any more net balls. Okay, there's one, two, three. Please lock in, lock in, lock. Yes. All right, Mantike was caught. All right. Uh, what else? All right. Cute water flying. Mantike living in Galar seems to be somewhat sluggish. The colder waters of the seas in this region may be the cause. Uh, so no nickname. You're just gonna go into the box. There you go. Sent to the box. All right. Uh, I'm gonna go up here and heal everything really quick. I feel like I need that because uh, a lot of my guys are low. And then I'll then I'll use the travel across the way. Got a cool bike here. Uh, yeah, rest the Pokemon because they're all pretty injured. All right. What a party. All right. So now uh, I'm going to, you know, continue across the water. Route 9, and I got a new bike that can go in the water, so I'm awesome. Whoa, what is that? Do I want that? No, I don't want you! Oh my god, you're big. Pelipper. Sea Dog is here. It's hailing. So I'm assuming Pelipper is just a flying type. How do you spell that? It's with one L. Pelipper. Yeah, it's another water flying type. So, oh, this comes from Wingall? I remember when Wingall was almost in contention to be part of my main party. Uh, Pelipper, I guess? Yeah, I don't know, man. Uh, do you want to be on my team? No, I don't, I don't want you on there either. Let's switch Pokemon. Let's uh, do Go Lurk since he seemed to be pretty good at just using a non-effective move. Plus, we can level him up this way. I don't even know if Go Lurk is going to be my team overall. Spit up. Ew. All right, Pelipper is hit by the hail. Ow, ow. Let's do Heavy Slam. Missed. Stop it. What is that? Right, come on, Heavy Slam. This will be not very effective, but still maybe do a lot of damage. Or right, not even in this case. It's going to do a lot of damage in this case. That's okay. Let's uh, try a different move then. Let's do a Mega Punch. This is a normal move, so. Here we go, Mega Punch. Hopefully this doesn't kill him. All right, that's not bad. I'm gonna try an Ultra Ball. I mean, I don't even really want Pelipper, but whatever. I could just uh, evolve the one that I have. You know, uh, anyway, Ultra Ball, sure. 
Here you go, get in here. What's the other thing? Got him. Belliper was caught. Awesome. So now, uh... Let's see, it is a messenger of the skies carrying small Pokemon and eggs to safety, and it's Bill. No nickname for you. Uh, send to the box. A pretty feather. Uh, place item in my bag. There we go. And then there's this thing over here, which looks crazy. What is this? Ew. A wild gastrodon. I feel like I've gone up against one of these before. Maybe not. This is a, oh, a water ground. That's interesting. Okay. It evolves from Shellos, okay. So this is a water ground. I was wanting a ground type. And a water type will be able to attack uh, ground, rock, fire. Let's go ahead, I, I was wanting a ground type. Let's go ahead and fight him. I'm gonna switch Pokemon though. Uh, let's do, Galurk is a ground, I have a ground type. <laughs> All right, whatever. But he doesn't have any ground moves. That's the problem with Galurk, he doesn't have any ground moves. He's a ground type with no ground moves. Here comes Body Slam, uh, I got hit by Hail, whatever. I'm gonna try to capture this too. Gastrodon. I don't know what the next gym is gonna be. Let's do Mega Punch. Here you go, Mega Punch you in the face. That's pretty good. Let's do one more of those. And then I'll try to capture you as well. I don't know if I can do one more punch. Let's do, uh... Let's try this, Heavy Slam. All right, that's not bad. Cause he's still gonna get hit by hail. All right, go lurk, no ground moves. All right, here we go. Uh, let's go ahead and capture this now if we can. All right, dude, come on. Ancient power. Ow. Not very effective against me though. And I hate this hail going on right now. We need to ride my, I need, I need to get out of here. Let's go ahead and do another Ultra Ball. Please get captured so I can leave. Here, okay, one, two, three, locked and loaded, right? Yes. All right, Gastrodon was caught. Awesome. Level up Golurk again. Can you please learn a ground move? Is this, is Phantom Force a ground move? Let's see what Phantom Force even is. It's a ghost move. 9100. The move hits even if the target protects itself. That's nice. This is 8100. We could do uh, Iron Defense is interesting, but Mega Punch is also, it's a normal move. Heavy Slam, the Steel move. Ability Klutz, what is Klutz even like? Phantom Force. Uh, this is one that gets me, okay, so I don't wanna replace, this, this takes up another move. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of Mega Punch, maybe, or Iron Defense, what do you think? Do I even care about Iron Defense? I don't really, I don't know. This is a normal move with a low accuracy. Let's get rid of Mega Punch. We got Ghost moves, he doesn't have any ground moves. All right, here we go. All right, Gastrodon's data will be added. It secretes a purple fluid to deter enemies. This fluid isn't poisonous. Instead, it's super sticky, and once it sticks, it's very hard to unstick. Uh, no nickname, and you're gonna go into my box. All right, let's get out of here then, please. I wanna ride. Thanks for this. What the heck is that? Ew. No, 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 ew. I mean, yeah, I wanna catch you in a second, but ew, for now. Oh my god, no thanks. That's big. 
A little fish jumping around here. There's another big fish. Okay, I'm gonna go back up and try to get that weirdo octopus thing. That thing's pretty cool looking. Oh, where'd he go? There he is. Hey, buddy. What is your story? Wow, a wild grap locked. And a grap locked is what? Grap locked is just a, it's just a fighting. All right. Fighting are weak against uh, flying and psychic and fairy moves. I'm gonna switch Pokemon though. I'm gonna switch to F Dog. I'm gonna try to capture this. It's level 50. I can now capture Pokemon up to level 50. F Dog is himself level 50, right? The 52. Reversal. Here we go. It's an interesting fighter. Uh, I'm gonna use a Brick Break and try to weaken him. I hope it doesn't faint him. It probably won't. Let's try it. Here we go, Brick Break. All right. Super power. Let's use a bug move. Oh my god. Okay. And defense fell. And he's hit by the hail. If he's gonna be hit by hail, then I might as well just keep trying. I'll try the Ultra Balls now. Try to capture him if I can. He's a fighting type. Nope, he broke out. Topsy turvy. Right, I got hit by hail. He's gonna get hit by hail. I might lose F Dog here. Let me try another Ultra Ball. It's a cool looking fighter. One of the coolest fighters. I wish he were a water fighter or something. Like something make him a little more unique. But he's uh We got him. Great. Grap locked is cool. Maybe he has water moves. I, I always forget about that. Maybe he has other moves. F Dog leveled up to 53. And Grap Locked. Uh, this is cool. Uh, a body made up of nothing but muscle makes this grappling moves of uh, this Pokemon performs with its tentacles tremendously powerful. It's a Jiu Jitsu Pokemon. No nickname. You're going to go into the box. You're pretty cool looking. All right. Let's. Uh, Let's venture on. I don't really. Oh. There was an item over here. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This is big. Whalmer. I really don't want a Whalmer. In fact, I might just. Uh, it's just a water. It's hailing. Can I run? If I can't. You know what? I'm going to put our dog. If I don't run. I, I, either way, I'm going to put our dog as the, uh, the lead so I can always run away. Because these guys are huge and they take up a lot of space. And you know what? Maybe I would just do... I could use a repel, actually. Let's use a repel for a second here. Where's the repel? Do I not have any repels? Maybe I never got any repels. There's no repel. There we go. There we go. Just for a sec. Oh, he's still there. Big pearl. Hold on. A regular pearl. <laughs> A regular pearl. Repel doesn't seem to be doing anything. No, it doesn't take long at all. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa. Okay, what did I hit? Whoa. Mantine. Pretty cool looking. Uh, Mantine is a water flying. Oh, it evolves from. Evolves from Mantike when when leveled up with a Rimmeraid in the party. I don't even know what a Rimmeraid is. Oh, uh, okay. So I guess if I would want this, I would just capture this. I got the other one, but I don't want to go through the problem of leveling up the Rimmeraid or whatever. Um, so Pokemon, let's switch over to Golurk. So I can use like the Heavy Slam or something. I don't know. I'll try to capture him. He's pretty cool looking. Aqua Ring. All right, he hit, he, he, okay. Here we go, get ready for this. Heavy slam, a steel move. Hopefully this doesn't actually kill him. No, not at all, not even close. I'm trying to just figure out how to weaken him without, you know, destroying him so I can capture him.
Shadow Ball. Let's see this in action. Pretty effective. Here comes a Shadow Ball. Yikes. Okay. We're not doing much here. Let's go ahead and uh, switch Pokemons again. I'm going to bring out uh, D Dog here. Maybe do like a rock move. Hold on. Water. I want to make sure I don't kill him. Uh, water. Fly. Is rock strong against. No. Yeah, it is strong against flying. Let's just hit him with the water move, I guess. I don't know. Actually, no. Water will heal him, right? So confused what's happening here. Um. Let's do a bite. Let's do a little bite here. All right, the bite's not bad. All right. I guess I just gotta wait until he comes back. And then uh, while I wait, I'm just gonna go into my uh, items here. I'm gonna use a a hyper potion on Go Lurk. All right, let's do another bite. It's so annoying that he keeps healing from this. There's another bite. After this, maybe I'll be able to uh, capture him. All right, let's 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 start the capture process. All right, here we go. It's a cute Pokemon, right? I think it's going to be stuck in the ball. There we go. We got him. There we go. Mantine was caught. Excellent. Sea Dog and our dog both leveled up. And I want to probably put our dog in the lead so that I can run away when I run into these things. Because I Mantine's data will be added. If it builds up enough speed swimming, it can jump out of the waves and glide over 300 feet. Uh, no nickname for you. Send to the box. And then, uh, yeah, let me go ahead and switch uh, Pokemon order. I want our dog in the lead so that uh, so that we can easily use the runaway ability that our dog has. If we get caught up. All right, here's a guy to fight. Black Belt. An item to be held by Pokemon. This belt helps the wearer to focus and boost the power of fighting type moves. So what's up, my dude? Aim for your opponent's weak spots and strike. That's all there is to it. So this guy is sending out what? Black Belt Carter is sending out uh, Grap Locked. Hey, I just fought a Grap Locked. It's a fighting type. So fighting type is gonna be weak against flying, psychic, and fairy. I have those moves on me, thankfully. So let's fight, uh, which one's better? This is 80, 70. Let's do this Dazzling Gleam, super effective move against Grap Locked. There you go. Adios. All right, super cool. T-Dog leveled up. Black Belt Carter. To use four moves, that's, about, that's all it should take. I don't even know what he's talking about. All right. There's a path over there. There's a island here. These guys are these guys are in swimsuits. <laughs> dive balls. Pokemon that live underwater. That's what I needed earlier. Dive balls. You guys want to battle? What are you guys doing? It certainly is a beach, but it's just too cold. I want to see what the lady has to say, please. What do you think about my secret beach? It's a small, mysterious paradise located at this very cool ocean. You've come all the way here, so I'll give you a present. Dive. Okay, I got the dive ability. Thank you. Diving on the first turn, the user floats up and attacks on the next turn. Your Pokemon won't be hit by attacks while it's diving in the water. That's right. It may be similar to my beach, which is so cold that nobody visits. Well. 
I'm on the prowl. I don't want to get any of these. These things are too big. Get me out of here. Hold on, there's a Pokeball thing over there. Alright. Max revive. And then let me kind of drive over here really quick. Don't hit me. I'm just looking, man. I don't know. I don't even know where I'm going. There's a big pearl over there. Something over here, too. Pearl string? High price. There's another beach like thing over there. Well, let's go up over here. Whoa, that thing has. What's up? Whether it's fishing or Pokemon battles, tight matchups are important. Let's see about that. What are you going to use? She's going to send out Quillfish. I'm assuming it's just a water. But let's look up Quillfish to be uh, exact. Quillfish is a water poison type. So if we want to use electric, uh, that's fine. If we want to use ground or psychic, that's okay. No, wait. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Sorry. No, I'm looking at the right thing. Psychic is good. Let's fight with psychic then. Here we go. I got a uh, psycho cut coming at you. Super effective. All right. Awesome. I got hit by hail, though. Uh, Piyu Kumuku. Piyu Kumuku. Is that how you say it? I probably said it perfectly. It's a water type. Uh, so if it's going to be oh, just a straight up water type, electric or grass. So let's switch uh, Pokemon and we'll bring out T Dog here. Here we go. All right. You're dead. Overdrive. Nice. Innards out. What does that mean? I was hurt. What? What? I don't like that. I don't like being hurt. All right. We got her, though. Losing with a spiky Pokemon makes my heart feel prickly. All right. Anyway, let's go ahead and then... Uh, Oh, jeez. Get out of here. I don't know if I like any of these guys. Hey, buddy. You got a camp going on. There's an item over here. Rare candy. There's a guy over here. Witness the results of the training I did together with Pokemon. This is sitting on another fighting type. Black Belt Reese. Now, Sock is a fighting type. So, you're dead. You're dead, dude. It's hailing, I know. Get ready for the uh, dazzling gleam. Super effective fairy move. Nice. Who's next? Level up D-Dog. I got hit by the hail. Not a big deal. Throw. That sounds like a fighting type. I'm just going to assume it is. Keep current Pokemon. Yeah, that's that's sock and throw. There we go. Fight against Dazzling Gleam. This is working out. Oh, man. Super effective, but not good enough. Revenge. All right. One more, it doesn't matter. I'll just use this. I should have not used it. I should have used a Psychic or something, but that's okay. Throw fainted. Now I can move on again. All right. Hiya, I lost. Looks like I'll need more training. All right, well, let's go ahead and move on then. Go get your training somewhere else. There's another one of those. Rock slide, that's neat. It's a uh, probably a rock move. Large boulders are hurled. They also make the opposing Pokemon flinch. 
Alright, I think we're doing pretty good. Hey, buddy. What, what you got going on here? I finished all my warm-ups. Okay, let's battle with everything we've got. He's not wearing any clothes. Swimmer Logan. He's sending out Wishy-Washy. That's going to be a water type, I think. So... It's hailing, I know. Oh, yeah, schooling. I remember this. So if it's a water type, I'm going to switch to electricity. So let's switch to T-Dog. Because we have uh, the electric overdrive move that we can do. All right. Hello. Aqua Tail's going to hit me and not be very effective, hopefully. Oh, my God. It killed me. What happened? What happened? <laughs> All right. I don't like you, wishy-washy. Uh, let's go. He's just a water type, right? Water, electric, and grass. I don't have any grass moves. I do. F-Dog has grass moves. Let's just go to Go Lurk. I don't know, man. I'll, try, I'll probably try to revive. Uh, let's use... Uh, what do we got here? 90, 100. There we go. Phantom Force. I like that. I get to avoid the move. And then come back and I do I still get hit by hail wherever the hail I am <laughs> let's get all right boom behind you that was pretty cool that was pretty sweet indeed aqua tails didn't hit me again though but I avoided it I hit by hail all right let's uh, let's do this schooling again he's losing his schooling ability I bet I could use the uh, I bet this this move would be really good then the steel move Let's do a heavy slam. Here we go. Got him. Not very effective, but he was so small and he fainted. So who's next? T-Dog didn't get nothing. All right, who's next, for real? Whale Lord. All right, just uh, keep current Pokemon, whatever. I don't have my electric types. Oh my God. Yo, big boy. Let's do Phantom Force. Here we go. I, I like how I still get hit by hail. Like, even though I'm gone. Phantom Force. I love this. Boom. That was great. That was a good one. Critical hit. That's what happened. Critical hit. All right, our dog and Go Lurk both leveled up. Our dog's 52, and then uh, let's see what we got going on here. I got tired from the warm-ups. My Pokemon and I gave it too much. All right, give it too much, buddy. I should revive uh, T Dog here. I could just use a max revive if I have one. I have two. Yeah, whatever. Use it on T-Dog. Use a super potion on D-Dog and go lurk. And I guess our dog as well. And then a hyper potion on F-Dog. There we go. So now, uh... There is some shiny stuff right here. I get off the bike so I can just walk over and pick it up. Normal gym. Normal, <laughs> normal type moves. Okay, great. All right, are we about? Oh my god, are we about done with this route here? Hold on. Maybe. Let me just double check. I'll come back down here. Another swimsuit girl in the snow. I'm doing research to see if one day I can swim anywhere uh, with my beloved Toxapex. What the heck's a Toxapex? Swimmer Lay Layla. Toxapex is coming out. Whoa. That's a cool looking thing. Toxapex is what? It's a poison water type. So poison is weak against psychic. So let's go ahead and just do a psychic move. We can do a Psycho Cut here. 
Here we go. Baneful bunker. Watch out. Spikes. What does that do? Protected itself. Dang it. It did protect itself. Well, how do you... Stop protecting yourself. How do I unprotect it? Okay. Will you protect again? Not that time. Beloved Toxapex is going down. Alright. Sorry about it. We gained XP. Catch a swimmer, Layla. Is this the limit of water types? No, I can still come up with more. She looks a little mad, honestly. So, let's go ahead then and... Uh, let's. I think double... There's another item up here. Found a pearl. Oh, this is the end of... Uh, uh, route 9. Let me just go ahead and explore up here really quick. Just to make sure I didn't miss out on anything. There's another... Okay, yeah, there's another person. This is a berry tree. Want to fight? I'm all rested up, so how about you be my opponent? All right, sure enough. Swimmer Scarlet. Rimmer Raid. All right. Uh, it's hailing. Is this just a fish? Uh, is this just a? Uh, is this just a uh, water? Okay. So again, if we switch Pokemon to T Dog, maybe I can do an electric move. So let's see about this. Bubble Beam coming at me. Ow, that tickles. And I got hit by hail. He got hit by hail too, though. Super effective overdrive. Let's do this. Here we go. I'm a punk rocker. All right. Here we go. Uh, what was it? Keep curve. If it's a water type, artillery. Oh, that's cool. What is artillery? Just out of curiosity, what type is it? Octillery is a water type. So yeah, we're just gonna blast you with overdrive. She's got three Pokemon. If they're all water type, they're all gonna get hit, hit with overdrive. All right, good for me. Hail again. Mantine, so yeah, this is a water flying, right? Mantine. And if it is a flying, then we don't gotta worry because flying is also weak against electricity. I don't remember if it is a flying, but... Oh, actually, I don't know. I think it is. Anyway, yeah, overdrive is super effective. Here we go. One more overdrive hit from T-Dog. There you go. Holy cows. Mantine fainted. Rip in peace. All right. Scarlet defeated again. She hates me. All right, we're about done here. Let me just, uh, I guess I'll shake some berries. I don't even use berries. Shake it a few times. All right, let's do one more time, one more shake. Let's do one more shake. All right, quit. I want, the, I want those berries, there we go. I don't even use berries. Oh. Bottle of pee pee. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go up over here. All right, face off against tra trainer tips. I don't care. All right, I have not face off against this guy. Swimming trains muscles. I'm sure it does. Swimmer Jacob is here. Cloyster. Seems it's like a water type, but let me just make sure before I do anything else. Cloyster. Oh, it's a water ice. That's interesting. So it's going to be... Uh, that's going to cancel out the fire weakness of ice. It still has a grass weakness, and a, oh, it has, but now it has a fighting weakness, which is pretty cool. Uh, it also has a steel... And uh, no, the steel weakness is not a thing. That's canceled out. Okay, let's just uh, Pokemon. T-Dog with electricity, here we go. 
Let's do what we gotta do. I think I'm about done with this route. Whirlpool is gonna hit me. I'm tra trapped in the vortex. No. Oh my god, stop it. I don't like that. Overdrive coming through. You didn't use protect? Come on. Yeah, okay. Keep getting hit by hail. And this whirlpool. Jeez. Come on, let me use this. I can wipe you out if I can just use this. No, another protect. All right, I need to definitely use like a hyper potion. All right, here comes the hail and the whirlpool damage. I might just die here. Two, okay, here, I can use the hyper potion. Use it on T-Dog, please. Icicle Spear. Ow. Ow. Okay, stop. Yeah, how many do you have? Okay, four now? Come on. What the heck? Oh my god, five Icicle Spears. I hate you. All right, I'm gonna try another move of mine. God dang, dude, T-Dog is being wrecked today. No, 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 we don't care what's in the bag. I'm gonna try to just fight and use Overdrive. Got him, finally got him. Cloister's down for the count. T-Dog leveled up, thank you. To deal with the shock of losing, I'm going to swim far, far away. Please do. All right, anything else over here? Oh, here's something, hold on, dang it. We can run away with our dog, though. All right, it's hailing, I know. Run away. Here we go, got away safely. Excuse me. Chester Bay, I know. Protector. It is loved by certain Pokemon. Dang it! Alright, here we go. Let me just leave again. Alright. Now I just wanna make sure that we got everything. So yeah, I've been, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we've been over here. Okay, okay, we got it. Let's uh, let's go back then. Oh my God, dang it. Whalmer. All right, I'm gonna leave again, run away. And then we're done with this route, so. It's been another episode where we just kind of check out the, the route. But this route was special because uh, we got a lot done. This is route nine still. There's something coming up. What is that? Oh my gosh. Scope lens. An item to be held by a Pokemon. It's a lens for scoping out weak points. All right, something's going. Are we are we out of town yet? What is this? What is this? I can't enter Spike Month, so I've just been hanging around here the whole time. No one can challenge the Dark type leader like this. So Dark type, we know that. What's with the gaping shut? How am I supposed to get the gym badge now? Hey Z Dog, it's Marnie over there. Hey. I'll be right there, Marnie. There was like an item over here that I almost got, but then I didn't get it. It was, there it is. Three dire hits. So what do you say? Even a rundown place like this is important to the people in Pokemon who live here. No one can challenge a dark type leader like this. What's up, Marnie? Oh my god, Marnie, where are you? Jeez, you scared me. Okay, let's try to get through this. I thought you were over there. Marnie, where are you at? There you are. 
hiding from me. Can't hide from me, Marnie. Alright, here we go. First up, there's an item over here. Three guard specs. Marnie, what's up? What's, ha what's happening over here? I was born here, so I know another way in. If you want to get into the town, how about I show you the way? But you're my rival, so you'll have to beat me in a battle first. Got it? With pleasure. <laughs> With pleasure. Oh, no. Team Yell's here. Oh, no. Really? You've, oh, okay, you've had a pretty good win streak in the gym challenge, just like me. I respect you as my rival and all that. But I got too much at stake to go around losing now. So Marnie's here. Okay. You were challenged by Pokemon trainer Marnie. Lipard. All right, Lipard's so cute. And what type is it? Lipard is a Pokemon that is a dark. Oh, dark. Well, if we're going to be up against dark, we can practice now. Fighting, bug, fairy. I got a fairy move here right for you called a dazzling gleam. Sucker punch. Don't sucker punch me. Ow. Should have punched my horn and pierced your fist. There you go, Lipard. Riddance to you. <laughs> I don't even say good riddance, but riddance. All right, uh, what's next? Who's coming out next? Uh, Toxic Croak sounds pretty cool. Toxic Croak is a Pokemon type. Poison fighting, interesting. Poison fighting type. Ground Psychic. Psychic's gonna work. For sure, because the poison fighting is weak against Psychic. So keep the current Pokemon. Here comes Toxic Croak. That's a pretty cool looking frog. Who's gonna get Psycho Cut? Cause he's so emo. There we go. Marnie, I don't know if you know what's up, but I got our dog on my side. Level up our dog and Sea Dog. Excellent. Who's next? Uh, Scrafty. That who's that? What is Scrafty? Scrafty is a uh, dark fighting. So. Again, we're talking about being weak against uh, against Fairy. So no, keep current Pokemon. Wow, uh, let's fight Dazzling Gleam. Here we go. Yeah, if we're gonna be fighting Dark, Fighting and Fairy are gonna be my key right now. So we might see F-Dog or R-Dog back in it again. Morpico. I, oh, that sounds so familiar. What is Morpico? Morpico is a. Uh, oh, that's her classic one, Electric Dark. So the Electric does nothing to cancel out the Fairy uh, or the Fighting. So let's just keep staying here. Keep current Pokemon. This has really been really good. As expected of my rival, you really know how to get me riled up. All right, well, here we go. This is easy, dude. Here we go with a uh, Dazzling Gleam, super effective again. Yeah, we might see our dog up in this up in this uh, gym challenge, big time. All right. Level up, D-Dog. All right, there you go. What's with that? My Pokemon didn't get a chance to really do their thing at all, ugh. They did not, because you were using dark types often. My partner, Morpico, has been interested in you and your strength. I think I get it now, but I've got everyone in Spike must supporting me. I'm definitely going to get all eight gym badges just so I can have a rematch with you. Don't you forget it. I'll get my revenge in the Champion Cup. Anyway, I promise I'd show you a way in, so follow me. All right. I know a way in. How's Hop going to get in? So there is a way in. What is that noise? I don't know, but I know a way in. I'm going to go in. I'm in. Spike Muff. So I'm gonna rest my Pokemon. This place is dank. Oh man, Team Yellow is just in uh, all up in here. I don't like that. Anyway, we made it in. So I'm gonna go ahead and give my Pokemon a rest real quick. And we'll be done with today's episode. Team Yellow is all here. You, don't you dare make Marnie's more Pico cry, okay? Any trainer who's made it all the way to Spike must got a right wicked look to them. Yeah, look at me. Well, you made it here, so I guess there's nothing to be done. You better be ready to face peers. I am ready. I'm going to give my Pokemon a rest, and I think we're going to be just fine. 
with the dark type here. So let's go ahead now and be done with today's episode. Thanks for waiting, Rapidash, and the rest of your team should be all better now. Hope to see you again, and I hope to see you again next episode when we take on the leader, Piers, of Spike Muth. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop.